In this tutorial, we are going to learn the basics of using windmills with the create mod. Now there are multiple methods of making power with the create mod, but my favorite is the windmill. I find it's more versatile, it's easier to use, and it offers more methods of decoration than the other power sources do. You can do a lot of things with a windmill. So first off, what you're going to need to make that happen is a windmill bearing, and this is how you make them. You need some form of wood plank. Then you need stone, diorite, granite, all of those will work. And you need one shaft and you form them like that. And this is what you're going to get, a windmill bearing. And let's take a look. There it is. You'll see it gives power out on the back side and you attach everything to this side. So let's go ahead and take a windmill bearing and I'm going to do one right there. And here you can see there are options if you look at it with a wrench. It has either regular clockwise rotation or it can counterclockwise rotation. So either one of those. First of all, you're going to need to attach a block to the top to attach other pieces of the windmill too. And I like using wool for that block because it also adds to the power of the windmill. Now let's go ahead and add some sails to this windmill. Just like that. And like that. So now we have a bit of a windmill started. And for the sails, let's take a look at how to craft them. Right there you can see we use two sticks, an andesite alloy, and any kind of wool you want. So let's go ahead and attach a couple more on here. Now the way you start the windmill is you right click it with an open hand. So let's try that. And you can see nothing's happening. And if you look at what it says there, this contraption was unable to assemble. Attached structure does not include enough sail-like blocks. It says five there, that's how many are attached, and a minimum of eight are required. So if we go ahead and do that, and that, and let's give that and that, right? This should now work, and yes, it is rotating. Now this isn't that powerful of a windmill, but it will work. It is creating rotational force for you to use. So let's go ahead and turn this off for the time being. Yep, just like that. <laughs> That's not needed. As you can see, you can right click it with an empty hand and it will also turn it off. Now while I have the sails here, I wanna show you a couple things about them. First of all, they can be dyed and it's really simple. You'll see right now I have five orange dye and I still have five orange dye. It doesn't use up the dye, so why not use some color? Something else that can be done, you can take a shear and right click on the sails and it leaves just a frame. And as you can see, it does still work. So these are still creating rotational power just like the sail. And it's a really cool look. It can really aid in your decorating of the windmill and your area. And if you want to fix a sail, all you got to do is pick one up. And you'll see if you put it in your crafting menu, it gives you the option to get the sail back. Really easy. Now, sails are great, but they are a little bit expensive. So maybe you just want to use wool. It works just the same as a sail. And it's easier on your resources. So here we have a windmill, right? Well, I bet you this isn't going to work. Let's take a look. Nope, it doesn't work. That's because we need to glue wool together. So take a bit of super glue and connect it together, just like that. Now you can see it's connected to the system and we can right click it and the system works. Now you may notice that this windmill is rotating faster than the first one was. That's because this has more sail blocks. And the more sail blocks you attach, the more rotational force you can get out of your windmill. You can attach up to 128 blocks before you reach the max power that a windmill can create. So let's go ahead and turn this thing off for now. Well, there you have it. Everything you need to know about the basics of creating a windmill in the Create Mod. I hope you found this tutorial useful and maybe your Create Creations just became a little bit more creative. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you next time. Ooh, you ain't feeling if you're trying it. Ooh, gotta believe the future's better. You owe it to yourself to do it. Only brings you joy. So shut up all that noise. Yeah, shut up all that noise. Hey, just chill. I got all the time to kill. Yeah, I got good vibes. Good vibes. I'm too blessed to give in to any stress. It's only good vibes.